Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Banished. I'll be your guy, Awesome and, awesome and Cool, you may call me my, by my real name, Adam or etc. So, and basically my series is about that I guide you into the game of Banished, which is a survival simulation game. It's a great game, once you, once you understand the concept of it, of it. and this is this is literally the, ser the, se the series that is for my own gameplay and for your enjoyment and, and, the, and the viewer's enjoyment, which is you and to help you out in the game. So, in the last episode, we began creating our herbalists, our gatherer's hut, two gatherer's huts, and we're continuing working on hunting and calving. And then our crops of potatoes are almost done. They're 26%. Wow. <laughs> so, let's get started into our guide. Okay, so in Banished, there's three resources. Actually, then there's resources that you get from mines and quarries. There are stone, timber, and herbs, and uh, berries, and nuts. Your, you know, your things you find in nature, and also iron in the map. What you don't find in the map is that coal, and coal is what you can get from mines. If you build a mine, you have more chance of people who are miners to get into accident and die. So it's best to not do that until later on in the game, for more of these advanced cities, for the more advanced buildings, such as a town hall, a church, etc. Because these will cost high resources, and this will be a difficult time to to make the building. Your main focus should be is farms, getting more f berries from your gatherer's hut. Um, get hunting, hunting cabin so you can get uh, venison and deer meat and also leather, which you can create clothing for, since what we started w is with was chickens. And chickens are an another way of, for a n good source of food. But they don't produce leather. They produce eggs. Which is still a good re good training resource when you cr create a train post or a, mer for, or a market. Oh, fucking bug is in my, in this, my computer room. This is outrage. Um... So it can speed up the process again. So now, my villagers are creating the gatherers' huts and the herbalists, which is good to to do right now. Ooh, that is sad. Carrot the Builder died during childbirth. That's that's actually sad. So people can die from natural causes. Uh things in the quarries, and mines, etc. Diseases. So if you don't do what I tell you to in, in my guide slash gameplay slash tutorials, you're potentially going to get screwed. And no, I'm not trying to insult you, I'm actually trying to help you and criticize you in a positive way. Natural tree trees will fall off because they're old and they usually die. I know I'm not making that up. 
I'm being quite serious. Now, because I live on a very s small land to start in, like, between two rivers, this would be an excellent... I can make a fishing dock right here, once I'm good with food. i will create the herb boys first. Now, if you want to be... Le use less people for one profession, I recommend using one herbalist. One herbalist c can supply for about 300 pop. Just a tip. And a little bit of vice. Alright, we got that guy working. This is what I call magic. <laughs> Alright, it seems like we're well in stone. So let's get some stone. Not that they're still collecting the resources I sent them out them to do. Yes, you will use that. Alright, we just need one for this profession, so let's give that guy... There we go. And, if you want to create more room in, in a tight space like mine, you should create wooden bridges so you can access more resources in the, like, the landscapes around you. Like, I can make a bridge here and collect all this landscape and make some farms, like, over here. Like farm area, houses, blacksmith, tailor, etc. And I can make another bridge across to collect more all of those resources, etc., etc. But advanced buildings you can use when you're running out of resources or you just want to make the job easier for yourself. But keep in mind that if you create a quarry or a, or a mine, like I said before, you have a more chance of people dying of causing death and like the death rate will go up, so be ca be careful. Hunters. There we go. The potatoes are almost ready. It's early summer, first year. And we're still getting... <coughs> we should start creating our logs. Now, the second winter, I recommend you starting making blacksmith and a tailor. So, during the second winter, you, your citizens are properly clothed and have enough supply, en enough weapons to, s to supply your citizens. One more log. <laughs> Where is our sit? My god, my golly. Now, what I should do is I should create a fish. Fishery right here. What should I... would be a good spot. Where is our hunter's hat? There is our hunter's.
You can hold on that project. So it's layer. There we go. We started with two herbs. That is great. That's a good start. Yes, great making your goodness stuff. No, I think it's best if I chop this area right here. Make, make it more make it more pretty. Just a thought. Just tell me. Now there's this option in the settings called increased priority. Chop that little forest there, so we get some more wood. The laborers you should always have an extra, because they are the ones who collect the resources and place it into buildings. The builders would be the one who's actually building it. <laughs> A laborer. There we go. This game can be relaxing at a, con at a contemplating level. I'm just saying. It's 89%. Our potatoes are still getting 97! Woohoo! Let's check over our hunters, they're doing their work. Getting something to eat, getting something to think he's working. There we go. Don't mind if you just take this little hill right here. That, yes. Hmm. What else should I remove? This area right here as well. Make things more pretty. Now this is a good grant place for effectiveness. Now if you want to go through tunnels without risking take making a oh my god that'll be a long way you create a tunnel but that will cost a lot of stone. 45 per, per length. Which is pretty expensive if our if you were if, if our that. Now, to make this, this is too, too big of a mountain. Um, what is a good spot?
Yes, collect the food. We have two laborers, which is good. 